What's up guys, Kyle here with Crypto Theory. All right, short video for you today, but we wanna cover this because I think it's finally time to start talking about Ripple a little bit again. You know, we'd been shying away from talking about Ripple. We really wanted to let a lot of this SEC stuff kinda, you know, blow away a little bit. Obviously, it's still a big story. However, I think a lot of the big FUD that was coming out about that uh, is is starting to kinda fade away. And, you know, hopefully this, this whole uh, lawsuit gets settled one way or another pretty quickly, whether they settle out of court, whether you know something happens in court either way uh, in my opinion i think that things are starting to look more bullish uh, in that regard for Ripple. And I think the price is going to reflect that here very, very soon. Now, we've got some news from Brad Garlinghouse, CEO of uh, XRP Ripple, uh, straight from him that we're going to talk about here and speculate a little bit, have a little bit of fun, because after all, the channel name is Crypto Theory. We got to speculate every once in a while and have fun with it. You guys seem to like those videos. We like making those. So we're going to jump right in and talk about it right now. Like I said, we're not going to take a lot of time, but I want to kind of talk about things that could happen should what we're going to show you guys end up becoming the case okay so you can see right here number six and we we know the xrp has risen as high as number two back in january of 2018 it actually did pass ethereum for a very short period of time when it rose to its all-time high price of three dollars and forty cents which we can see right there it's been it now you can see it's down below a dollar right now so in my opinion just to get back to its previous all-time high now that we're starting to see and, and like i said we had been advising previously be very cautious with xrp mainly because we didn't know what was going to come out of this lawsuit well again not professional financial advice however in my opinion it is looking better and better all the time for ripple and i do think that they're going to come out of this um, victorious or at least if nothing else then they settle out of court and and get this thing taken care of so that they can get the ball rolling and moving forward because they got some big plans as far as what they want to do okay so just to get back to its previous all-time high you're looking at huge gains right there However, I think it's going to go much higher than that. We're not going to do a price prediction in this video. This is going to be more uh, just kind of keeping you guys up to date what's going on, a little bit of speculative stuff towards the end of it, and then we'll pick that up in a different video talking about some price predictions based on that, okay? So for anybody that's not familiar with what XRP is, honestly, I don't know how you couldn't know what it is at this point. I mean, you know, it's all over the place. It's been around for a long time. It's been in the news big time obviously this this bull run and everything but for anybody that doesn't know what it is basically it's a digital asset built for payments it's the native digital asset on the xrp ledger an open source permissionless and decentralized blockchain technology that settles transactions in three to five seconds okay so basically if you're not 100 percent sure what that is it offers financial institutions banks basically the fastest most reliable option for sourcing liquidity on demand okay huge project massively important great use case all the stuff that we look for and they have one of the best teams and tech overall in all of cryptocurrency okay so in terms of overall tech teams use case all that ripple knocks it out of the park like i said the only reason that we were staying very cautious with this because we love ripple i mean it's a great project the only reason we stayed cautious about it was because of the whole sec lawsuit well here's some interesting news coming straight from brad garlinghouse ceo of ripple okay he basically went on to say the likelihood that ripple is a public company is very high at some point very interesting stuff right there and all you have to do is read this first line right here xrp offers financial institutions here's the main difference between xrp and xlm which is stellar lumens another project that we really love um here's the thing a lot of people have a hard time deciphering between the two. XLM, okay, Stellar Lumens, they go after the unbanked, okay? They are going after the people that don't have access to banking for, you know, uh, international cross-border transactions, stuff like that. XRP, Ripple, is going after the financial institutions. They are going after the banks, okay? And there's not a whole lot of things that are more centralized than a bank, okay? So, uh, you know, with that being said, they're, they're, you know, they're kind of playing in both spaces, in the decentralized and the centralized space. So it kind of would make sense that they are looking at becoming a public company, okay? What would this ultimately mean? And you can read on and go through, you know, go through the, uh, the whole article if you want to, basically. But he basically says, the, the likelihood that Ripple is a public company is very high at some point. In the middle of an SEC lawsuit, you know we need to get that closed out. So basically he's saying we got to get the SEC lawsuit resolved first. And you can see he goes on to say the good news was the court did grant Ripple's motion. All we've asked for for two, two to three years is the regulatory uh, clarity. And I think that this is progress. Okay, And then it goes on to talk about the whole, the whole battle between the two. But I think the most interesting take out of this article 
is the fact that he is talking about the the potential of Ripple becoming a public company. And this is just from you know uh, a day ago from the time of this filming. What would that look like? What could that create? Well, like I said, I don't want to get too much into price predictions in this one right here. We're going to have a separate video for that. It's such a new article. I haven't even had a chance to kind of fathom what that would mean. All I can say is, look, Ripple has you know, the Ripple army, basically the, the loyal followers, the people that love XRP, there's a ton of XRP holders out there and a ton of people that back this project. Okay. It's one of the largest crypto communities out there. Think like Cardano and some of those ones that have just massive, massive social followings. Ripple's right up there. I mean, Ripple has a massive following of loyal people, loyal fans. Think about the backing that they have. Now, the other thing is think about like when Coinbase went public. Okay. Coinbase had a massive IPO, and I think down the road, Coinbase is going to have a very, very successful run. Uh, obviously, they already do, but I think that the, the stock price is going to continue to go up for Coinbase. It was it was pretty high when it first started, and it kind of pulled back. I think it's going to end up being down the road a big winner for people that, that bought into it. But think of what this could do for Ripple, not just from a stock price standpoint, but overall for just you know crypto in general, having a project like this that goes public, but also what what could it do for the price of ripple okay what could it do for the price of xrp i mean like i said i don't even want to fathom how high that could be in this video i'm just saying i want to put this on your guys's radar that this is if if everything gets settled with the sec lawsuit and everything gets figured out the ceo of ripple literally just came out and and basically said it's imminent that ripple becomes a uh, publicly traded company i mean you guys do the math what that could mean for XRP as a crypto, the price of uh, of an XRP could absolutely skyrocket further than any of us could even possibly imagine where it could potentially go to. Okay, so again, they have a huge following. It's one of the best and biggest use cases in crypto. They have one of the best teams. All the stars are lining right now for this. As long as this SEC stuff gets taken care of, uh, everything's lining up that they could go public. And if they do, this price is absolutely going to go berserk. Not professional financial advice, just my opinion. Guys, we will have a price prediction on this as we have a chance to finally dive into it and kind of you know think about it a little bit. Because um, this news is so new, we wanted to get it out there to you guys as quick as possible. So let us know in the comments below, what are you guys' thoughts? Do you like XRP? What happens if this thing goes public at some point? What's going to happen with XRP? How quickly does it grow? How big does it go? Uh, let us know in the comments below. With that being said, guys, that's all we've got. Have a great rest of your day. We'll catch you in the next one.